So for this short video, I'm going to show you how to use the die cut stencil sheets. A lot of people ask how do you use them when we're doing demos and the instructions are on the front and it is literally step by step and there's photos there where you can follow them. But I'm going to show you now how you use them and what it is, a die cut stencil sheet turns your dies into stencils or masks for adhesive sheets. So I've cut it in half, the sheets come in here for, I've cut it down to size. I'm going to just pop it onto the die. This is a leaf die from Sizzix. Pop it onto the machine. Make the usual sandwich and die cut it. And when I die cut it, you can end up with a positive and a negative. I've covered a card with double-sided sheet of adhesive. I'm now going to just cut off this excess so that it's just the card that's covered. So this is the type of thing that we're aiming for, which is unusual because you can use two different glitters or two lots of beads. So I'm just going to use the Piazza tool just to lift this backing sheet. And I'm just going to lift that back and that will expose the adhesive. Now, this is the stencil or mask that I made for the adhesive, so I'm just going to Lay the card flat and place this down in place. So that's the stencil sheet has covered the whole card. I'm going to take one of the new clean and clear trays. Some of the sticks to green glitter from the tri packs. I'm just going to pour over the leaf and cover the whole thing. I'm going to pop this back into the tube and then I'm going to peel this off. I'm going to take a few micro beads and then I'm going to cover the whole card with the Sticks 2 iridescent glitter. I'm going to pop it into the tray and cover the whole card, cover all of the adhesive. So you can do this on tags, on scrapbook pages. And then we've got a lovely two-tone, and that's your die-cut stencil sheets. Mm -hmm.